Hey, what's up guys? So I'm coming to you with another unboxing. This time it's Gooby Roaches. Um, I keep uh, two lizards as well as my new snakes. Uh, I have a bearded dragon and a leopard gecko, so they eat their roaches. Um, I currently have a roach colony in the mix, but it's still not ready to be fed from. Well, at least for my bearded dragon because she's big. She needs the larger roaches, so yeah. I, uh, this is the last shipping. This is the last order of roaches I'm ever gonna buy online. After this is done, my roach colony should be good to feed off from. So that's a plus. Um, and right now, my beauty is old enough to not eat roaches every day, so this should last me a while. She's gonna be eating mostly veggies from now on. She's a good thing because she's kind of fat. <laughs> so, anyways, this is from buydubiaroaches.com. Um, I've ordered from these guys before, and uh, it's pretty good. They have really good shipping. Um, I like their packaging, as you can see. They do it in a, a, a sack. Um, it's pretty easy to get these guys out of it. So that's what I like about it. It's less messy than sticking them in a box. So yeah, here we go. The only thing is, I'm tying this. Sometimes it's tight, really tight. But other than that, it's pretty easy shipping. Oh, let's get to this. Oh, this thing's really tight. I guess it's good though, because it can't get out. But. There we go. There we go. There we go. So yeah, these are the extra large roaches that I ordered because, like I said, my girl's pretty, pretty big. So, uh, so you can see, and they always alive, arrive. Can't talk right now. They always arrive alive. So I've never had like any dials from these guys. So they're pretty legit. So you can see, pretty healthy. They're not skinny or anything. Anyway, let's get these guys. And here, I was at a 200, so this should last me a bit. So I like this sack thing where they uh, put it with the egg crates because the roach is just stay on the egg crates and then I just pull them out pull the egg crates out so you can see I have carrots in there so they ship them with food make sure I'm not losing oh I got a pretty big one in here this, is, this guy looks like it's about to molt into an adult okay get this guy off very quick let's make sure there's none My rabbit being nosy. Get out of here. I'm sure there's none on the outside. Alright, so I got a few in here. Just gonna fast forward this for a bit.
I don't know, what's up with all these little carrot pieces and stuff? No, whatever that is. It's like dog food. It's definitely dog food. Never shipped them with dog food before. Whatever. I'm not a big fan of uh, feeding so much protein to roaches. Mostly because uh, you have to be careful how much protein your lizards get because that could definitely affect them negatively. So, but whatever. These guys should be fine. No harm or for a day. My roaches, my colony, I feed them only. Um, only feed them uh, oatmeal and uh, greens. So, not saying it's wrong, it's just not what I like to do. I prefer the more natural approach. It's just me though. Anyway, let's just get these guys off this quick. Boom. Yeah, be careful when you're taking these guys out the, the egg flats. You're shaking them. It's got to start flying everywhere. But luckily, they stood in the bin. Definitely. So, yeah. Alright, and that's it. That's all of them. It's all 200. Um, yeah, if you guys are thinking of getting roaches, definitely check out these guys. Um, it's good quality roaches, and they're also pretty inexpensive, so, yeah, check them out for sure. I'm gonna feed these guys some, some oats. Let's get them there all now, quick. Put a piece on that. I'm gonna throw in a piece of, uh, veggie, something that I, one of the vegetables that I give my lizard. Just feed them that for uh, some hydration and yeah, they're all set. Thanks for watching guys.